It's Friday night, and I'm headed to an art gallery. The first aspect that I found a little bit confusing to start was that it's not on the street. Uh, you have to actually buzz in, although to be fair, I didn't buzz anything. I just snuck in behind somebody else. I don't know what's going on. This is really cool and I'm scared to walk into a pane of glass. What happens when we step into the list? So, for those of you who've never been to a gallery before, I mean, I've been to a lot of art galleries, but never, I don't know, there's something weird about it, something kind of uncomfortable about it if you never, if you don't go very often. So this is kind of, I brought, I hired an art consultant. This is Lerka, and by hired, I mean she's just hanging out with me. What do you, I mean, am I dressed okay to go into an art gallery? You're definitely dressed okay. <laughs> I mean, there's no dress code to go into a I gallery. I going to say, what if I showed up in a t-shirt? Uh, no, and if you want to dress in a crazy costume, they'll just take you as a... As you are. Regular visitor because a lot of the people that show up here yeah. are like uh, the crazy. Okay, so that's the thing. I walked in, I went to this first one by myself a little bit and walked in and was like, what do uh, art galleries are free, right? Mostly? Or and, and all the galleries are free. All the galleries yeah. are free? Yeah, all galleries are free. Yeah. Usually you only need an invitation for the opening night. You have a, a preview or you have drinks of, of the coming exhibition. Yeah. And here in Paris, they change the exhibition every second, third month in, in each gallery. Either they do solo shows mm -hmm. or they have a group show with different artists. You will usually see on these opening nights that that's where you'll see crazy costumes sometimes. You'll, it's also attracting the fashion crowd, art students, collectors, everybody. Usually the VIPs will have like a pre-preview now, but... Uh, I'm not going to any pre-previews. People have this great expectation that yeah. uh, the artist is going to be the crazy one with the funny hat standing yeah. in the middle. Usually, actually, the ones with the funny hats are the visitors or those who want to hang out with the cool crowd. Yeah. And the artist will be very anonymous, standing in a corner, being shy. That's my <laughs> experience. And he will be the one actually standing only in a t-shirt and jeans. Yeah. yeah, way more, way more casual. What are we? So, are there any more that are open right now? Yeah. You want to uh, go see another one? Yeah. Okay. Let's go. We're gonna go see another one here. It's raining a little bit. So we're walking between places. I think, is this where we're going right here? No. Okay. So we're just gonna go check out a couple places. I know that a lot of you would like to go see galleries while you're here, go see art while you're here, but you might feel a little bit intimidated or unsure of how it goes. You're not alone. I think it's kind of intimidating too to go into an art gallery unbidden. So let's come to the experiences today. I'm also just admiring your amazing umbrella. It's so nice, isn't it? Yeah. Just trying to run out of open galleries, unfortunately. Just got a late start to this. Look, wait, 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 wait. Are those suits from the Matrix? No. Oh, that's what it looks like. It's from Alex Israel. Oh, well, then if he's American, then it's bound to be good. Oh, let's walk. Oh, it's open. Merci. I am the Batman.
Okay, so this has been amazing. Uh, I haven't been in an art gallery in a long time, and there's some really good stuff in here. So, do you have to have an art education to enjoy this? Okay. No. Do you have to know much about art? No. Can I buy Is this it, art if I really like it? If you have enough money, yeah. <laughs> if you ask politely. I don't I, have enough I know money. that these guys, they don't sell to just anybody. Ah, you have to really... Yeah. Well, I think... Uh, demonstrate an appreciation think for the art. I think if you're from a museum or an institution, oh. uh, I, that would be the people would, could argue that I'm from an institution. A couple other questions people might be wondering: How late are these usually open? Seven o'clock usually. When do they When do they open? I think they open around eleven o'clock. So eleven to seven. That would be eleven to seven. That would be okay. Safe. No slurpees here. Oh, can you bring food if, in here? No. No food. No. Can you take photos? You can take photos. Yes. Thank God. Video. Video also, yes. Definitely, thank God. On opening nights, uh -huh. they are open till usually like 9, 10 o'clock. Do they have champagne? They might. Ooh, okay. yeah. yeah, but they're not worried about the bubbles sp sprinkling on the art. There are no rules nearly on opening nights. No rules. They keep saying that. They said no rules at the last place too. But the first place, I asked if I could swing on the chandeliers and she said, okay, one rule, don't touch it. And I was like, ah, dang it. Okay, I shouldn't have asked. The one well, rule is don't ask. Everything with respect and oh. yeah. If you have the money to pay the bill. I was gonna say, it make for a very memorable video. <laughs> oh, these guys came too late. See, it's already after seven, so game over. You were lucky. We were lucky, awesome. Thanks, Lerka, this was a lot of fun.